Good morning, students. In the last video, we had discussed about the functions of management. Today, we are going to discuss the nature of management. In this topic, you need to know everything about the nature of management. It is hard to define the nature of management. Different people look at management differently. While a, math a mathematician defines management as a logical process, but psychologist considers it as a, is an art of understanding human behavior. Still, these approaches are very narrow because they look at only a particular field of management. Management experts, according to management experts, management can be broadly classified into three categories. They are management as an art, management as a science, management as a profession. To understand whether management is an art, science or profession, one has to understand the meaning and meaning definition and features of art, science and profession and then associate them with the features of management. Okay? You will hear this year of the Guru Nirvahaniya Swarupa Thakadu. Nirvahaniya Swarupa, even to me, even to me, even to me, Nirvahaniya Swarupa Thakadu, even to me, 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 Theoretical knowledge. 
theoretical knowledge. Art requires the existence of theoretical knowledge. Means all art subjects are based on theory. For example, written material or uh, literature is available on dancing, public speaking, acting, music, etc. Okay. Here it is sir. Uh, art what is it requires a theoretical knowledge here. Okay. Yes sir. In the same way, there is uh, a lot of uh, the literature available in uh, management in the field. Okay, uh, each one has his own style and approach towards his 
job. Are you understanding here? Yes. Uh, although theory is theory is same for every artist, but each one has his own style and approach towards approach means uh, here uh, method towards his uh, job towards his job here work here. Okay. Yes. Sir. That is why the level. Machine. 
surgery okay this is 5 ms it combines the management combines the uh, five ms or human and non human resources in useful way in order to produce achieve the best possible result okay a good manager works through combination of intelligence imagination initiative and innovation okay this is how it is creative okay management is also creative in the nature okay yes sujanashilati anta naam karide pratiyoba kalavidanu sujanashilati ennu hondiruttare sujanashilu gunavannu hondiruttare hagaage avanu hindittu iradantaha asagandannu srishti madodakke mundagutane anta helbodu okay idu astitvadalliruva saitantika jnanavannu sujanashilavagi alavadisikolluvudakke sambandhiside anta helalagutayide okay idakke enbekagutte ee sujanashilu Great result. 
like okay in the same manner management also directs the efforts of
there is availability of organized and systematic study material it has its own theory and principles so let us conclude let us understand that so the first feature of science is present in management okay yes nirbahani vidyana vagi vidyana ಉದಾಹರಣೆಗೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಏನಿದೆ ಅವರು ವಿಭಿನ್ನ ಸಂಸ್ಥೆಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ವಿಭಿನ್
ಇಂಥ ಪರಿಸ್ಥಿತಿಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ವ್ಯವಸ್ಥಾತ್ಮಕ ತತ್ವಗಳನ್ನು ನಿರ್ವಹಣಾ ತತ್ವಗಳನ್ನು ಪರೀಕ್ಷೆ ಒಳಪಡಿಸಿ ನಂತರ ಅದನ್ನು ಅಭಿವೃದ್ಧಿ ಪಡಿಸಿರ್ತಾರೆ ಯಾರು ನಿರ್ವಹಣಾ ತಜ್ಞರಿಗೆ ಉದಾಹರಣೆಗೆ ಯೋಗ್ಯ ಸಂಬಳವನ್ನು ನೀಡಿದರೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಒಂದು ಉತ್ತಮವಾದ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ತೃಪ್ತಿದಾಯಕವಾದ ಸಿಬ್ಬಂದಿಯ ಗುಂಪನ್ನು ಸೃಷ್ಟಿಸಬಹುದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಲಾಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಓಕೆ ಸರ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಫೀಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸಲ್ ವ್ಯಾಲಿಡಿಟಿ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸಲ್ ವ್ಯಾಲಿಡಿಟಿ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸಲ್ ವ್ಯಾಲಿಡಿಟಿ ಓಕೆ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಿನ್ಸಿಪಲ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಬೇಸಿಕ್ ಟ್ರೂತ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಆಸ್ ವಿ ಆಲ್ ನೋ ದಟ್ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಿನ್ಸಿಪಲ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಬೇಸಿಕ್ ಟ್ರೂತ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ದೀಸ್ ಪ್ರಿನ್ಸಿಪಲ್ಸ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಅಪ್ಲೈಡ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಸಿಚುವೇಶನ್ಸ್ ಎಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಆಂಡ್ ಎಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಎಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಲಾ ಅಷ್ಟು ನಿಖರವಾಗಿರುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ಭೌತಿಕ ವಿಜ್ಞಾನ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ಯಾವ ಯ
ಅದನ್ನು ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟಾಗಿ ನಿಖರವಾಗಿ ವಿಜ್ಞಾನ ಎಂದು ಕರೆಯಲಾಗುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ಓಕೆ ಎಸ್ ಹೋಪ್ ಯು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟುಡ್ ದ ಟಾಪ